Tom Giacobbe with Dental Town Magazine. Today I'm in Irvine, California with Sean Keating of Keating Dental Arts. So what one bit of advice would you give a dentist that's searching for a new lab? Um, talk to the owner or talk to the senior management and see what you want, what you expect, and it's very important to do that at the very beginning. How do you use technology to work with dental practices that are remote? You know, we have a lot of, uh, obviously email is so important for us. We, we have a lot of dentists, like when it comes back to the shade, you know, issue. Still old school, picture, camera in the mouth with a shade tab on what you think is as close as you can. If you can't get the number of the shade, you know, it's a C1A1, that's fine. Just write it in on the picture, say the left one. One of the things that a lab can do well with their clients is to provide consultation on a case before it's started. Mm -hmm. Do dentists take advantage of that service enough, do you think? I don't think so. And you know, as we sit here and talk about that, it's probably the most important thing. Um, and that's where dentists, you know, there's a lot of dentists that, you know, they write an A2 and they send it in the script and they, and I think those days are kind of gone. You know, I find dentists more and more that do call in, they're calling in more than ever. I've had dentists that hardly never call and lately they're just trying to be better, trying to do a better job, and trying to think it out a little bit more. And Sean, what would you do on this? And what do you think? And you know, we can go up over a couple options and I think they really appreciate that. And I think that's what sets us apart too is dentists know that they can call us anytime and kind of go over things. You have a monthly meeting with your staff. What's one thought you like to leave in their minds at the end of every meeting? I always say that every crown you make could go on dental town, so make sure it looks good. How have you adapted to the new choices for restorative materials? Uh, very slowly. We like to really look at the product and evaluate it before we make any decisions if we're going to offer it. Is the PFM crown as we know it dead man walking? I don't think so. You know, I still do quite a bit of PFMs and it's tried and true. And you know, I can layer it four and five powders and I can make those PFMs dance and look as good as any all ceramic out there with the right prep mm -hmm. and the right reduction and uh, it's still a great product and uh, shouldn't be forgotten and we're not going to forget it. We're going to push it hard. Your lab has adapted to changing technology. Tell me about the addition of the Roland milling units. Uh, it just made my life so easy and less stressful. It is such a great product on the consistency and just I think it's just like you know how I remember with cars and I remember when Toyotas came out and it was just or the Hondas you know all you do is put gas in it and you know you can go 200,000 miles on it and they just don't break down and that's what my Rollins are but yet the precision of them are second to none and it just made me embrace the CAD CAM technology more than ever because I finally got a company that got it right of making a system that just is so robust and is so consistent in the quality how has the addition of technology impacted the hours that the lab is operating? You know, um, I had a logo that I made way back in the day and our tagline was creating smiles every day because we kind of do have a seven day a week, um, you know, program, you know, that, that come in at six, they leave about three and then we have people coming in at four and they're leaving about midnight one and then we have a crew that comes in from like one to five, one to six and and it's weekends and, you know, and that's, that's just the way it's always been. So that, that, uh, that tagline really comes in now of creating smiles every day because we truly do pretty much 365 days a year. CAD CAM dentistry is hotter than ever. What is your take on digital impressioning technology and how is it impacting your dental lab? It's unbelievable. Um, you know, I just really, really love the, the way I can get a file emailed to me and to be able to do this dentistry. And the whole thing, what I'm seeing is the accuracy. Mm -hmm. I almost wish for all my high remake doctors, like I've and let's see the difference and you're going to see it. And I've had a few dentists that have got into it that were having issues here and there and impressions and distortions and it goes away because you know what, it's so magnified it makes you kind of practice good dentistry. Right. And you really need to, you know, put your thinking cap on in those first few months of getting it dialed in. It's just huge after that. This, the consistency and accuracy is what gets me more excited than everything. Labs nowadays have the potential to be almost 100% machines. Is this a 
Is this a goal, appropriate goal in your mind? Uh, no, not for us. A lot of guys will go that road, and that's fine. But for us, it'll never be that way. I mean, it's almost, you know, 50-50 in a way. And I don't think it'll go much more than that. Maybe, you know, 60-40 or something. But it's just, I'm always going to have some of the best people working for me because you're going to need that. Um, you're going to need that to work with the dentist on the phone, treatment plan. You're going to need that, like even too with some of our products, you know, that are kind of uh, done CAD CAM full monolithics. We have expert certified dental technicians or master dental technicians that work on all those cases at the end. Your lab's always been an advocate for education. How do you how do you accomplish this goal? You know, we do everything we can for the dentist to make their job easier. Mm -hmm. And that's my whole vision of this dental lab is to be more of a dental company to help dentists. I mean, what's the magic thing to get a dentist to try my lab? You worked in another lab before starting this one. In fact, you worked in a couple, which is similar, very similar to the path that many dentists will take. What are some of the lessons that you learned from that experience that influenced the things you do the same or differently at Keating? That's a good question. <laughs> My ours is a classic tale that, you know, anything that could go wrong did go wrong, but I just always kept it as always about the people. Take care of your people. Always had open door policy. You know, the janitor to the top management has the same rights to come through that door and talk to the big guy or anyone in this company. And, you know, you take care of your people and it'll come back tenfold. And to this day, you know, we still do. And they're the most important thing, you know. Keating Dental Arts is a true family business. Your wife and your two sons have been involved in this company ever since you started it. How is that an advantage? It's an advantage because it's not only my family, it's the technicians. They feel like Shannon, my wife, and Kyle and Travis, my boys, it's like their family, you know, and the dentists. I mean, it's awesome. I love it. You know, I loved having it to where, you know, I would say your name's on the building, guys, you know, and they're very respectable boys, and thank God, you know, there is a husband and wife, because she take, they take after mom a lot in certain ways, and that's good, and uh, real humble, good boys, and, uh, you know, Travis does all our CAD CAM stuff, all our designs, been our number one guy from the beginning, and he's huge, taking on a management position in that area, kind of yeah. really helping, you know, uh, drive the digital part of the Keating, and then Kyle's taking a big step, and, um, you know, helping out with all the marketing marketing and doing all this, you know, uh, all the website and uh, he's going to be really driving. We have a new uh, thing called Keating Digital that we're going to be selling uh, different uh, CAD CAM machines and maybe some uh, um, some scanners for dentists and stuff, but it's just a, another arm, a little, a little rebel division of Keating Dental Arts called Keating Digital, but uh, the boys will be very uh, integral in that part of the Good. company too, so. What is unique about your dental town dentists? Clients your lab. Most all the accounts that I get through Dental Town, they're they're pretty sharp, you know, and 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 they know what they kind of want. And uh, but my guys with, uh, you know, that have been with me, they kind of stick up for me and you know protect our Keating Dental Arts online. And they're you know they're really it's their company, you know, in a way they help build it, they help yeah. shape it, and you know uh, when they refer someone that it's coming from. Uh, a person that really knows what we're about. So it's not just this, it's it's kind of a, it's a neat thing when I get referred from a, one of our buddies on Dental Town. You fought very hard to get the Bruxer name available to any lab. How does that make you feel? Well, it makes me feel really good. I had a lot of laboratories call me saying, you know, hey, I use Brux or I use Zer and I, I can't use this name, I'm being told. And I'm like, you know, it's just not right sometimes, you know. Um, but it's the American way, you gotta defend yourself sometimes. And I stood up for the lab industry, you know, kind of, um, Bruxer's a generic term, okay? It's like saying you can't trademark water or, you know, boxer or anything. It's just, it's a name that has uh, been used for many, many years in the dental industry. And, you know, our Keating Dental Zirconia is for Bruxer's, basically. And any lab out there that wants to use a Bruxer name, hey, Get out there and use it, you know, and, uh, and send the thank you and note. Send a thank you note to me. Maybe send a dollar for every lab, maybe, and help me pay these lawyers. Sean, thank you so much for spending the morning with me. I appreciate your time.